Welcome back to part five of our videos on the multi-language management feature of REDCap. Sometimes it may be desirable to have a record of individual, an individual's language at a top level so you can quickly identify what language the user filled out the survey in. To do this, we're going to go ahead and use some of the additional customizations. It's important to note this isn't necessary for the multi-language management and isn't really using the multi-language management features. Uh, but can help us to stay a little bit organized to know who used which language. So something to note, I'll click on online designer. And in my project, I currently have a question for uh, which language they're using. And I've also have this action tag for at language set to let it know that these are relating to the codes. That can be added if I go in under the action tags here. And these are the same codes I used from those ISO codes back in video one. If I go back to my project setup and I go in to additional customizations under enable optional modules and customizations, I have this option for setting a custom record field. And here I'll give it the variable names in square brackets that I want to appear. So I already typed this out and just am copying and pasting. Record ID is gonna be square brackets, and then an underscore and which answer from that language option. And when I say save, it says it's been saved. I go to record status dashboard. Now I see instead of it just being one, two, three, I have the language they provided there. Something else to note, if we look over in the options for view all data, I haven't really filled out too much, but we can see if a person has answered in a different character set, it will still have the other character set, but for multiple choice answers, it's just going to show you the default language. So here it says blue and green, even though the actual answers on the back are uh, coded with a different uh, character set. That doesn't apply to the free text, which they'll be typing in, but for multiple choice, it will provide the default language option.